and welcome back. We're here continuing uh, the story mode for Mortal Kombat X. Before before we begin, let's look at some stuff we got here. Okay, so back one. Got one, one. So back one seems to be a commonly used uh, opener. Back one and back two. Got a grab here, looks like. Overhead. Okay, so looks like one and two are your openers here. Perfect. Okay. What are the moves? Straight arrow, lunge kick, up, up kick. What does that mean? Is it like a dive kick, or just? I guess we'll find out. Once I stop getting shot in the face. Oh, okay. It's just literally that. Perfect. What's that? This is also like the only time I've ever played Kung Jin is literally this. I know he was uh, commonly used online because apparently he's pretty easy to use. I guess we'll find out. You should be embarrassed. So we've been doing a little happiness is a warm guy. Uh, a showcase of their X-rays. So I guess let's try and do his. Watch him block it. No, he didn't. Okay. Ow. All right, you know what? That's not uh, that's not terrible. He didn't get uh, shafted in the X-ray aspect. Okay, so that's like the. A lot of people have a move like that in this game. Oh well. That's a weird. It's like he kind of kicks you with the back of his shins, or his calves, like. Learner. Just kind of falls on you. That's weird. So it is, um, what's the day? It's the 14th, I think today is. So we're just a few days away from the reveal. Anticipation is building. Rumors are abound. There was some kind of leak about um, who they're showing off. Don't know if it's any legitimacy to it. I hope I hope not, because a lot of characters on that list are, it's like, Son like Sonya we've heard about a lot. It's just kind of basic stuff and nothing really super exciting yet. But uh, we'll see. I'm sure when we actually see what the game looks like in motion, we'll lose our fucking minds. So here we have Farah Tor. Farah being the little kid up on its back, and Tor being the monster. There's some kind of shit about them being like a symbiotic relationship where they they can't survive without the other, and how when the big one dies, the little one becomes giant and eventually gets a little writer, I guess. Not sure how that works. Well, Farah is dead. Oh, apparently she's not. You hear make trouble, skinny? Uh, trouble make you. So that uh Farah obviously voiced by Terra Strong. It's kind of cool how like no matter what you do, she flies off and immediately gets back on. Pretty cool. Some interesting animations going on back there. I'm gonna try and get something going here. Oh yeah, wrong move. Oh god. Oh, the damage! What was that? Did she cut him? Alright, I gotta get the win. Oh fuck, I didn't get the win! Oh, okay, I still did. I salvaged it. I need, like, a second to breathe here. Well, now I don't have any meter. So I can't do what I was trying to trying to do. What else do I have to work with? Chakram, Loach, also it's like a projectile. Another one? Yeah. Why does he have that if he has an arrow, though? Like, why does he this if he's got... If, he, if he's got that. Very confused as to why they thought that was necessary. Okay, well, got through that one. Love to learn more about you. Too bad you're insane. Oh. Okay, well, Tor is dead apparently. You guys all right? <laughs> I 
So, those heels that Devorah is walking on, are those like part of her natural body? We're here to see Kotal Khan. It kind of looks like it, right? Her eyes are cool. As we honor the Rapal Accords, we will consult the Emperor. You will they mention the Rapal Accords a fucking lot without explaining it in the actual game. You want to take this I hope Eleven deals with that a little bit. I gotta wonder why you'd risk inter-realm war for a bread thief. Because not all thieves are irredeemable. Ah, yes. The backstory. So this outfit looks infinitely better. It's literally just like a Assassin's Creed, almost. A sa thief outfit. That almost looks like the Shell and Monks cover art. Can I get someone in chat? Someone in the comments? Is that what that's from? I'm kind of I'm mad that I missed out on playing um, Shell and Monks when it came out. I still never played it myself. I do not have any of the consoles that that game was on anymore. It's a damn shame. All the more reason for them to remaster that shit. Or just make a new one. It has more sentimental than monetary value. I have a feeling though that they would they would send that off to a third party developer though to it's a family heirloom. make it because I just, I'm I mean these fucking Mortal Kombat games and then Injustice takes up like all their goddamn time. Your family honored me with this memento of your cousin Lao. I wonder how long Netherrealm though is gonna do that cycle. At, at some point they gotta wanna mix it up. They can't abandon Mortal Kombat. They're just this is their this is the bread and butter. This is the Call of Duty. Not far enough. And if they got if they stopped these, man, I would I thought the series was dead, honestly, before this PS2 game started coming out. Just because time I felt like there was forever since like before a game came out after four. You know, when you're a kid, time passes really slowly. And now it's too fucking fast. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm in a different... I'm in a different uh, variation here. What do I got here? I got the arrow, I got the kick. Wait, am I not a different variation? No, I am, right? Why does he got the same... Okay, same shit, I guess. Can you not... How do you meter burn that kick? There you go. It wasn't, it wasn't coming out with the combo. Alright, just get through it. Just get through these fights so we can see the story. I am I am not a pro with... Oh, jeez. Especially not with these characters that they make you play as. It's weird that that's still there. Because Wasn't the other one... Uh, Oh wait, you know what? No, I'm wrong. I'm sorry. I was looking. I'm thinking of. I was looking at Ferret's Wars variation. So it's like, why am I? Why am I not in like the ruthless variation or whatever the fuck? Because I'm not that character. There we go. And it was style. Style, not skill, because it doesn't take a genius to do that. Okay. Ooh, faction XP. That's Just exciting. Blood of Kung Lao, descendant of the great Kung Lao, the common thief. Ah, uh, so the second Kung Lao is not great. Into my temple and walk out again. Is is the great Kung Lao that they're ref the referring to? Is that the same Kung Lao that was that they you. did in um, Why? Mortal Kombat to Conquest? Your anger, make I think I started talking about that in the last episode, but I I got distracted by something. Like Has anybody seen that? Is it's uh, it's it's worth watching. It's it's kind of bizarre, like watching it back in, because um, I recently just watched one the whole season. There's only one season. Your ancestors. Uh, one that, cause that was on TV. I want to say it's the late Go '90s, right? Like right around the time the Matrix came out, I think. Like and uh, good lord, I 
all of the women were wearing basically Except nothing in that show. And this was on is fucking broadcast TV. I think it was on, like, fifth, uh, what was it, the W, whatever the WB network was back then. It's too late um, for me. Like, UPN, maybe? Some, I think, oh, that is the Warner Brothers network, isn't it? Uh, it is God, it's not good. Cool it's terrible, but... God, like it's so it's if you're a Mortal Kombat fan, it's pretty fucking enjoyable just for like just to see what they were thinking. The news of refugees is troubling. Their exodus to Earth it's like, was they had Quan Chi in it. Shao Kahn was in it all the time. I do know this. Reptile like started fucking no somebody. It was weird. Earthrealm. Like people were having sex like Certainly every episode. It didn't make sense. The execution of justice. MK was never really a, a sexual with game like but yeah so a lot of the chicks were dressed you know sexy because that back then that's just kind of what everything no. did that was the standard no we're not even sure that shinnok's amulet she has she employs shinnok's amulet against me the very item earth realm swore that's even still the case with a lot of japanese games when outworld was offered no participation we i appreciate that though Khan, the fire that burns bit of a callback i don't think everything should be we share your completely pc we intend no Ill or most things, for that matter. Uh, now I'm getting off on a soapbox. Back to uh, back to MK, everybody. Can forge words like silver, but I recall an Earth Realm expression: "There is more honor among thieves than diplomats." I've had the questionable fortune to be both. It's weird that he's in the shot with I'm the statue of the himself. <laughs> you are allied with Melina. You may carry out your sentence. Wow, that's a Total that's a brazen assumption. Outworld law, I claim the right of defense. What's interesting though is why would why would Earthrealm side with Melina, who's using Quan or uh, Quan Chi, who's using Shinnok's amulet? That doesn't make any sense. It's kind of dumb of him to assume that. You know much of Outworld. No, also the duel ends in death. All right, well, here we go. You have won nothing. Our last fight with Kung Jin. A few more seconds of breath. Thank God. Oh, God, he blocked it. Er, that was a parry, right? Do you have a parry? I know that. Oh, no, I did. Sorry. I absolutely did. I found that out last time, of, uh, last episode I was playing. Oh, shit. See, now he's, like, styling on me, showing me all this shit that I couldn't figure out. Oh, fuck, would you back off, dude? Totally missed. Oh god. Oh wow. Okay. All right. Here we go. We're gonna we're gonna start that over. God, not having any knowledge of these characters is really making this difficult. That was supposed to be a uh, cross up. Didn't didn't happen that way. Oh, I was supposed to. Oh, damn. That meter. Uh, Version is not coming out. Fuck it. I should just use it. Okay, yeah, here we go. Just get the damage. I got nothing with the uh, meter burn moves, so. I don't know what you call them in this game. They don't really have a name for it except meter burn. EX attacks. That's again, that's a Street Fighter deal. Okay, here we go. Just get the win. Just don't worry about it. We're not here for the, the fighting of it. We're gonna. After this story mode's done, we're gonna do. Um, We'll do some towers with the characters I actually use, and it'll, you know, it'll be better. I won't feel as stupid. I'll feel stupid, don't worry, because I haven't played this, like, consistently in a very long time. On your knees. Throw did not come out. Power. Oh. Oh, I'm dead. Am I dead? I'm not dead. Oh. Ah, oh, damn it. Alright. I was gonna try to use the x-ray. Alright, here we go. God damn it, we have to do it again. I'm not skipping the fight! As much as I want to just skip the fight to get rid of- get away from Kung Jin, I'm good. Just do as much as we can. Perry work on projectiles? I can't imagine it would. Give it up. 
Hey, remember in Justice how like 80% of the game is this? Just fucking keep away from me. All every, every character had like so many options from uh, far range. The name of the game. Oh well. Well, apparently it worked. See, it happens when he gets in close. Ooh. I honestly, I didn't follow up because I didn't think that was gonna connect. I thought he was gonna hit me first. Oh shit. Can I like... Oh. Oh, I was trying to... I guess you can't combo into it. It wasn't coming out. The more I see it, the lower that score goes. <laughs> There we go. He ran into it. Perfect. It all went according to plan. And now, Emperor? The charges against you are void. I say to all that Earth Realm means outworld no harm. Now you kicked my ass, so now I believe you. With it. You're not actually gonna. You're not actually... You probably should have, in hindsight. Instead of your life, I claim your service. If Melina does have the amulet, we can get it from her more easily if we work together. Emperor, they cannot be trusted. Zora, can you not perceive? I am indebted to them. You, you picture Shao Kahn saying shit like that? <laughs> That'd be fucking weird. I'll talk to General Blade. Tell her about our new arrangement. Thanks for the heads up, Sergeant. Stay with Kotal Khan. We'll figure out next steps once I've got Oh, God damn off. it. Yes, ma'am. I'm so I've I've never liked Sonya either. I don't know what it is. It's just He's like it's just so it's so bland to me. I try I try to like expand my horizons beyond the ninjas. And I guess in the cyborgs, because that's kind of like of course they're the coolest ones, because look at them. Uh, Sony does not fit that bill. Especially not in the next one, since, you know, it's probably, it's probably going to be fucking Ronda Rousey. Tell her we're investigating. I thought that was Lee May in that body bag for a second, so, so I stopped talking. I was like, oh, maybe she won't be in MK11. Shinnok's amulet has been stolen, replaced by an exquisite duplicate. Damn it. Something is wrong. I will speak so how did she get it? Raiden? Raiden! Lieutenant, I need you Is to there a thing like in the comics too? I don't remember Raiden if they talk about it. I'm pretty sure I said that in the last episode. Sorry, What's it's been a few on? days since that, so I like already forget What's everything I talked about in that, <laughs> in that episode. You said, why are you bothering me? And I said, because my ex-wife is a pain in it. Where are you going? You can't just walk away. I'm in this too. Not my decision. Thank your buddy, Secretary Blake. This is what split us up in the first place. You disappear in your work. It's Never funny to note that Sonya is kind of the one, the reason that they split up. You'd you imagine it'd be Johnny, but no, he's kind of the good husband and dad. Time when you cared more about your family than your job, General. Nope, no evil sorcerers in here. Would you get oh, okay. serious? Quan Chi needs to clean up his man cave. Back to, wow, so Johnny Cage with a gun is weird. <laughs> you're comparing me to Quan Chi? Only in terms of cleanliness. What's this? I wouldn't do that. Oh, yes, the Lazarus oh, Pit. Come on. Where's your sense of... Adventure. You wish for adventure, you shall have it. Fire! I will fight all four of you. I well, they're dead. Your soldiers, but you and Mr. Cage will serve me well once you are dead. God, fucking 
Quan Chi just gets bitched out all the time. Don't know when to quit, do you? Okay, so oh Jesus. Uh Sonia, what in the fuck do you do? Okay, so we got some one back one. I like a fucking every button in the world. What's that look like? Let's check it out. Yeah, that's about what I expected. What do you got? Uh, airdrop. Ring. You got the kick. There it is. Sure, classic. I like that handstand, though. Look at that little fucking plant. What was the energy? I thought I did the energy ring. What is it? Oh, okay. No, I, I did do it. I just... I guess I fucked it up. What is that thing? Where did it come from? It was not there in the cutscene. You ready for a lot of that. Got him! I, knew, I nearly always miss that. They always block it. I'm just slightly out of range. Fuck. Oh, I missed entirely. Alright, uh, that was pointless. Alright, perfect. Not as tough as you look. The stage is kinda cool though. I don't think I've ever really noticed the winding staircase that much. Fucking nice. It's like an inverted bulldog. Quan Chi, you've lost. A delay, Miss Blade. The inevitable still beckons. Johnny! Oh no! Oh shit, I forgot about that. <laughs> I like that even though he's like possessed evil, he still has fucking like tech on his arms. They gave Sub Zero a, hu a new human body, but they couldn't give Jax new human arms. <laughs> and we have Evil Johnny rising up from the pool, whatever that is. You won't be dead for long. This will not happen. I will beat you with my fists. What else she got? Oh, the drone. That's that's the deal with this thing, right? I don't know how to make it do shit, but yeah, I have no idea what to make it do. Let's check it out. Let's see, because I know she's got some weird shit. So drone. Park, what does that mean? Remove heavy bl Oh, so you gotta do okay. I got it. Perfect. Now we got some shit. Is her X ray a parry? It is. And he just happened to trigger it. I like the sounds of the cord in that. That's kind of my favorite part of that X ray. Gotcha. Ow, ow. Peter always holds on that. All right, let's fuck with the drone in this one. Ow, he hit me. Okay, so that's like a... Nice. Now, there's so much, like, shit to do that drone. People who play Sonya at the, this variation and well, they have my fucking respect. So much shit to remember. Oh, it's just armor with you when you get that. Alright, that's what the X-ray or the X-ray. EX version of that does. Perfect. Okay. Sonya feels pretty good, I'll it's be honest. Jacks. Not like that. Well, probably like that. I don't know. She's not real. I'll get you out of here. You'll be fine. Don't know. Blood's supposed to be 
on the inside. The more I look at them, the faces in this are, are kind of rough. Raiden. Like, just a little bit. I must reverse Do, fucking step. way better than nine. Don't get me wrong. So what's he speaking there? Is he speaking anything? It's working. You cannot save him. <laughs> That was a shot in the trailer. God, Johnny Cage is mine. No, he's mine. Save him. I've got this son of a bitch. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm starting to come around on Sonya. <laughs> a little bit. I a little. A little tad. A little tidbit. Oh, shit. Pathetic displayed. <laughs> Oh, fucking, I forget that's an overhead. I don't want to use the x-ray, though. The armor. Perfect. And shoot him. All right, cool. All right, we got it. It's kind of annoying. The My broadcast bar is covering his meter, so I don't know how much meter he's got. Now I know he had two, and he used them. Oh, he's two. So that's a high kamikaze. It's a pretty cool move. Ah, oh, fuck. Did you knock it off? Hit me! He didn't. Fuck. Alright, well that's the risk I take. We got through it anyway. It's fine. Oh, I forgot. This cuts. Okay. That Again, different monster in the background. You deserve. Got a beat down coming up. Fueled by QTEs. Sonya Blade, the link with Quan Chi is not completely severed. Not a problem. Uh, we'll sever the link, and among other things. Oh. One, two. He's already like fuck. Three, right in the fucking nose. Ah, oh, I love when they work the X-rays in there. <laughs> Get the shit out of here! Oh god, fucking giving me a concussion. Oh shit. Fuck. Oh, here's the kicker. No. <laughs> no! Oh, I don't have a button prompt for that one. Oh, she twists her foot. So the key to freeing their friends is to literally stomp them in the nuts. But they're all fucking free. Making a scorpion human again was one of the best fucking decisions. It makes it makes him so much more interesting all over again. The others are restored to the living. He desperately needed something By new. Coupling Quan Chi's dark magics to my own, I was able to restore their souls. Is he gonna make it? Haven't I told you? He's a god. Huh. You scared the shit out of me. And <laughs> they said I couldn't do horror films. <sighs> He's gone? How did he... We gotta go after him. He can wait. Right now, we need to get you and the others... <coughs> Probably should've just killed him. him. 
Alright, so we got through two characters in about 30 minutes, so 15 minutes a character. It's not terrible, I guess, right? And that was... What chapter was that? Five? You seem to know this Kano Oh, well, never mind. She's not done yet. Not the word I'd use, but yes. I thought that was four. I, I think that was just three. Until he escaped to Outworld after Shinnok's invasion. Why would he return now? All that matters is he's... Caught. <laughs> that looks so weird. Gotcha. Hello, love. Been a while. Not long enough. This is General Blade. I need MPs to my location immediately. Right. Sorry, I'm just watching this now. Friends. A trade. Info for freedom. I don't negotiate with scumbags. Well then, if mother won't play nice. Maybe daughter will. If you ever. Back off? Then all's well. Piss me off. And Cassie's gonna meet Uncle Kano. I swear to God, I'll kill you. Let's just do it then. The time has come. So have I. Oh, we traded. Oh, no, we didn't. He had armor. This is the, oh, this is a different variation. Oh, that wasn't... Alright. Wait a minute. It's a drone drop. Nothing was happening. I'm sorry. I'm just down toing the fuck out of this. Sorry, hang on. Alright. I gotta... I gotta learn some shit. What's... What do we got here? Alright, she's still got these, those are the same. Airdrop, energy ring, those are the same. Leg grab. Reload Sonya's grenade. Oh, okay, I got it, I got it. That's what that means. She just has grenades. Alright, cool, got it. <laughs> I took a risk there, just fucking wake up super. Sometimes it works, especially against the computer. God, I'm really bad at timing that wake up. It gets me fucking killed so many times. Oh. Range on those suck. Ah, oh, fucking. Ah, oh. oh, man. All right. <clears throat> Still not skipping the fight. Here we go. God, it's so irritating playing games where you just don't, you don't know the characters. Nor do you really care to learn. So Sony, like, she's a little better, but still, just don't care. Right in front of it. Don't know when to quit, do ya? Those grenades are uh, tricky. Those are probably more extenders than anything else. It's weird that doesn't. It's not that consistent that string. Oh, the second I get it, he blocks it. Oh, God, it's like they... The computer kind of reads a little bit. They know exactly when to do overheads and when not to. 
It's a little bit infuriating. Okay, I'll take the trade. <laughs> Alright, now we're done with Sonya. No, I'm not done with you. Just kill him. All right. All right. Get off me. Sonia, ease up. You kill me. Never fight. Amulet. Move, move, move. Sonia, we need that info. Sonia. Don't make this another thing you regret. God damn, she got a fucking temper. Talk. The Platon jungle. Who do we got now? Devora. All right. Constantly to avoid detection. That's not far. Maybe two hundred kilometers. You know what to do. Yes, ma'am. Devora, I've played a little bit. Again, that was a long time ago. Have new information from Earthrealm. Kano talked. Gave us the details on Melina's location. She has the amulet, but she's got a lot of protection. We will strike immediately. Perhaps a two-pronged approach. The army will engage Melina, distract her, while this one retrieves the amulet. Not alone. I like how this one is capitalized. Stealth is of the essence. Did you not hear me? You may assist in the main strike. Laura, we will grant their request. And I will finally be rid of Melina. I don't want to help get rid of Melina, though. I like Melina. Ah, uh, see, there's the other thing called the alternate costume I was talking about. Ah, uh, fucking reptile, dude. Thank God they fucked you up so bad. It hurts my heart. Like others, this one is not pleased with Melina as color. But it is not clear your crew will succeed. That is why I invited our Zaterran friend. Listen. So he paints his body, this. right? That's what that is? I know things about Melina. Her troubled rule will fall in the telling and pave the way for Quatal. So I'm pretty sure uh, Steve Bloom also voices Reptile because that voice sounds very close to Gilemon from season three of Digimon, who he also voices. God, this fucking costume on Melina though, goddamn. About what I wonder. They got they made her look so much fucking better in this game. Council, as war with Nether Realm looms, I have urged Detente with Earth Realm. And I've told you I would sooner die than treat with my father's murderers. You refuse practical solutions to credible threats. You endanger the realm. And sedition does not? Speak your last before I have your tongue. You are not I, I don't like Ermac looking like a mummy. She is a construct formed in Shang Tsung's flesh pits. I saw this. Your best claim to the throne is moot. How dare you! I succeed Shao Kahn by his decree! Succeed him you have, but Outworld demands new leadership. From you, Arshtek fool. Kill him! <laughs> this one serves Nelina no longer! <laughs> you will defend your empress! Can I play as Melina instead? Baraka, you suck too. <laughs> Shao Kahn conquered my realm. I owe him my loyalty. I honor his will. All right, Devora, what in the hell do you have? 
Okay, sure. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, we got a, com a command grab combo here. Okay. Oh, nice. Why the fucking pokes? God damn it. Oh no, I missed it. I fucked it up. I fucked it up. I'm gonna die now. Is that the sweep? No, oh, okay. God, I'm getting fucked up. This is like the regular mode, by the way. Which is like weird, because... You would think it'd be like a little easier, because... Who the fuck knows how to play these characters, especially when you first play through? Is that Moloch back there? Pushing that thing? You don't remember Moloch? Alright, what do you have? Bug Blast. That was gross looking. He literally shits out and that's the and he's just dead. I keep doing this a lot. Her moves have a lot of startup. Damn it! It's one of those ones where it's it's like a weird angle. Is this the poke? Yeah. Okay. Plague me since MK2. Oh, I gotta do it all over again. Sorry. I, I, his will. Even if I like took time, I'm still not in practice mode. So I'm I'm gonna have no time to learn. So I just have to like, figure at least one thing out that I can do consistently. Like that. Her jump is weird. Oh, he broke it. Son of a bitch. I don't want to just do that. I'll do, I guess I'll do it. Alright, if I'm gonna try and get this x-ray, I'm gonna try and do it right. I know the angle's gotta be right. So, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna... Get some distance and do it. Perfect, there we go. Oh. Not bad. Oh yeah, I forgot. Actually, do a fatality in the cutscene. And Baraka is now canonically dead. Take her away. We would serve the new God, you look terrible, Ermac. 
then you serve. Kotal Khan. Fetch me my green paint. Okay, so much for stealth. Just walk right up. This one knows you desire the throne. Why serve Melina? I advise her. Stealing the amulet was my genius. It kills her a bit each time she uses it. As both sides diminish, you fill the void. Exactly my plan. He sounds like a shredder. A shame you will not see its fruition. Okay, here we go again. Oh! Holy shit! Are you kidding me? Fuck my ass up. Alright, hang on. Sorry, I just say that a lot. You have that. I'm just gonna fucking abuse the fuck out of that. Wow, that shit tracks. Okay. We got something going. Or not. <laughs> Second time they broke that. They really don't want to get stuck by that. I wasted it. And kill with it. I wonder if that's a brutality. That seems like something that would be a brutality in this game. Oh jeez. Fucking destroyed. Leaving without your friend, Devora? Your people believe we avoided your island out of respect for your solitary nature. We just didn't like you. The Katyn do prefer solitude, which I will achieve momentarily. The Katyn... Are they from... the day? Oh, fucked it up. Oh, I was trying to do the um, spike thingy into it instead. Her her moves, like her actual like special moves, are kind of terrible. Like the bug throws or whatever, and that I hate that thing. Mostly because I always get hit by it. <laughs> Damn it. Thought she would have moved or something. She did not. At least you already saw it. Now they know the precise second to hit. Moving on. Now two Daniels will die. I know you said you weren't friends, but you're not killing them. Head's fine, by the way. Why not? Very well. Let us go.
step aside. Ah, more creepiness. Alright, just... Is she, like, made up of... I know bugs constantly come out of her, but... It's like that weird thing, like, um... What is it? Spider's Van, where he's... Like, thousands of bugs just smashed together that think they're Peter Parker? Has anyone seen that? I think that's an actual thing. I think it was in the Spider-Verse comic or something. Now you wish to steal Fucking gross. Of reclaiming it. Neither was it for you. Who are you to say? I will take something of yours. yours this voice actor's life. going in. I, I know I keep saying it, but I'll be so fucking sad if Melina isn't in 11. It's looking like no, but... God damn it. That was a better run. I did the wrong. I thought I meant to use the butt bug. There we go. Okay, there we go. Is that four? I think that's four. Well. This it's been real, Melina. <laughs> it just has a throne there handy. Enough of your prattle. Finish me, that I may join my father. You do not deserve oh, see, I think this is our first look at her without the mask. Uh, God, the redesign on the teeth. Way better. Give the honor to my worthy first Making it part of her, like, cheeks. Oh, she got that sassy head swivel. Man, I remember the first time I saw this. I think everybody freaked the fuck out when they saw this the first time. <laughs> oh... That's... That is just gross. Oh, and there she goes. That's unfortunate. The rebellion is over. Well, thanks for that. I know I'll never eat again. With your leave, we're going to head back to Earthrealm. Put the amulet back where it belongs. <gasps> the hell are you and doing? And here's the dickhole move. Earthrealm cannot be trusted to protect the amulet. It will remain with me. The Reiko Accords require the that accords you... The Accords no longer concern me. But you may prove useful when Raiden comes for this. This one deceived them. The amulet is in Kotopan's possession. You can retrieve it. He trusts no one else. Ah, the plot thickens. Keeping you close to the outward. It's a double evil cross. She's even more evil than evil. They never suspected one of their own to be a disciple of our lord. This one lives to serve Shilk. You have done well. Now bring it to me. Without delay, Anji. These weird, like, fucking hell steeds. What news from our world? Shinnok will soon be freed. We make for my fortress. Is there a problem? Two problems. 
Those are just part of her feet. Oh, like knives or something. Farmer Jacks. So now different looking uh, metal arms. <laughs> Your wife told me I'd find you in here. This is actually a playable costume, I think. You and Vera have a nice chat. Always. Is that a national? I haven't seen one this. You didn't come here to discuss farm implements. All right. I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. My help? I know. I don't have any right you to... You knew what I wanted. Jackie volunteered. She came to me. I know. Listen. I get why you didn't want Jackie joining SF. Why you retired. I wonder if I mean, Jax will come back. Because in, in this he's like retired and he only comes back stands? because Jackie is in that I world or something. A long time ago. He could easily just kind of be out well, you know for the next one. Although, we're getting into some tra time travel bullshit in the next one, so, I mean, I, I guess, honestly, anything's fair game. I guess I don't need to be upset about Melina. With her, there's a possibility of the time travel thing, or just the fact that she's she's in a construct, so there could be hundreds of Melinas buried somewhere. He shows his face after 25 years, just as Shinnok's amulet is in play. That's not a coincidence. That's why I need you. Your Quan Chi expertise we wouldn't reactivate your commission you'd be an observer cage Jax what is it just wanted to see if maybe you could help close the sale <laughs> yeah because that worked out so well last time can't blame a guy for trying we need you Jax help me capture Quan Chi None of us is safe if he gets near that amulet. So we're so I'm just watching the story again. Outworld. With Cassie's team recovering the amulet. <sighs> She'll be fine. We expect to hear mission accomplished from him soon. Well, I mean... Not that soon. Considering where they're at. I love that they just have like a regular Earth prison <laughs> in Outworld. So what you guys think? Are they gonna kill us? They would have done it by now. Unless Kotal Khan's planning on having us as guests at the Coliseum. <sighs> well, if they don't kill us, my mother will. Me at least. Tough being the general's daughter? <sighs> you have no idea. I do. My great whatever grandfather took down Shang Tsung, saved Earthrealm. How often? Ah, that is the Kung Lao they're talking about from Conquest. That's how it opened. Six hundred years ago. He uh, won one of the tournaments, beat Shang Tsung. <laughs> no pressure there. I've trained all my life. Can fight my way out of nearly anything. But I still feel like a second-rate cage. <laughs> At least you grew up with people expecting things from you. I thought you and your dad were best friends. <laughs> now? He was a no-show for a long time. I can relate. What was that like growing up, having an ex-revenant father? Jin. No, I'm asking. Couldn't have been easy. He was just a bit overprotective. When I joined SF, Mr. Cage insisted on being the one to tell my dad. He thought it'd go smoother. <laughs> I'll never forget that day. My dad came home with a broken jaw. <laughs> All right, I got this. You've got what exactly? Trust me. So I think Takeda is the next uh, playable uh, chapter. It's a pretty cool shot. It granted it's just some jobber, but. 
Away from the bars. That's a deeper voice than I expected. Oh, a banana, thanks. There's a bread. Looks like a banana. <laughs> And it's just that easy. How'd you do that? I overloaded his senses. It only works at short range. Being the son of a telepath has its perks. I didn't used to think so. Yeah, Takahashi Takeda. Chapter seven. So we're yeah, we're we're just halfway done. Uh going by chapters. And we've only played this for about like two hours, so it's a fairly it's a shorter story mode than um MK9. Ah, our first look at Hanzo Hasashi. Master Hisashi. Now that I'm Chujin, how will I serve the clan? That sword stuck to Your nothing right there, by the way. Does not lie with the Shirai Ryu. But the clan's my family. When I took you in, I promised your father. I don't have a father. Yes, you do. One who's proud of you. A Chujin in record time. You knew he was coming? You said nothing? Knowing this would be your reaction, yes. Takeda, your father is not your enemy. Ten years. No visits. Nothing. You abandoned me. I did not abandon you. I was eight. My mother had just died. Now you come back? Think you can jump right in as a... You have a lot of credit to all the voice actors in this. Uh, everyone does a pretty really... Uh, a pretty really, uh, really good job. Okay, uh, that's going to do it for this episode of uh, the story mode. We have, I mean, we'll probably do, well, I mean, we took, it took two to do this, the half of it, so we'll probably have two more done. Um, so, let's see, when can I do this again? I don't know if Tuesday I'll probably be busy. It looks like Wednesday, and um, I guess, I mean, if we have to, if I'm super determined to finish it before the actual reveal, I guess I'll just do the rest of it on Wednesday. If not, then we'll do half on Wednesday and then the other half on Thursday, and then we can we can talk about the reveal in that episode, which maybe that works better. Uh, we'll see. All right, everyone. Uh, thanks for continuing down this trip of uh, memory lane with me on this Mortal Kombat legacy we have going on here. Unfortunately, not much of a legacy since, again, this is the only one I can stream for you. Sorry about that. Uh, but if you want, there's a podcast that I did um, the Energy Tank Podcast. You can find it on Spotify or iTunes or whatever the hell. Just a couple weeks ago, we did an episode where we were playing Mortal Kombat Deception. Um, granted, it's audio only, but, you know, it's, I don't know, it's it's a lot of fun still. We're doing the Conquest mode, and we played some Smash. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, everybody, and we'll see you next time.